Good morning, my friends. Booming here. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. Booming here once again with another morning drive video for you, my soul tour brothers and sisters. Why? Because this includes you. And if you don't already, hit that subscribe button because we would love to have you and want you to be part of the freak show here on YouTube. Anyways, my friends, so it's happened once again. It always happens. It happens, especially during the co content drought. Uh, it just And when people aren't happy. I get it, but of course, you run into the people who are like, Sotor is dead! It dead! You dumb for even playing, man! <sighs> okay, so here we go again. It, it, it's not dead. It's it's not. Um, <laughs> yeah, so you usually run into these people who have been playing for a long time, and a lot of them are very passionate about the game, and I get that, I understand that, and I appreciate that. And that, that's whatever. Uh, you, you, you know, people who have stopped playing. There are some people who are you know, who uh, who continue to play the game who uh, are spitting out the mantra of Soto is dead. You find me an MMO outside of ESO that uh, you that you that starts screaming oh, Soto is dead, and I will shave my beard. But it's not. It's not. I mean, the, yes, there's a lot of things people can pick and choose from to be. The, um, the, the, the signs of uh, MMO's demise. And so Tor's got a, some, some things uh, going against it that is true. And I, I won't deny that. I, I won't. And I think what we got is, you know, something that Blizzard went through with Warlords. They were a bit more on, on, the, on, on swift and foot with making the corrections than so Tor. But there's reasons for that, too. You're talking about a, a bigger company that has a giant staff available and dedicated solely for a single game they're working on. Whereas in Bioware, at Austin especially, you, you don't really have that, and teams are picked in, picked here and there to work on other IPs, other franchises. So that, that, that's a thing, and that, that's open, and I know why, and I can see why people get kind of a freaked out by that and you know I get that but and, and like I said in the con and some of them have been having a conversation with on the YouTubes about is you know I read I read their whole dissertation on why the game is dead and all this that or the other thing why it's practically just in maintenance mode and I understand and I get what they're saying however however I did say something like you know, it's we shouldn't be reading the small tea leaves that we have in a cloudy cup. We don't know everything that's going on behind the scenes. Now, as an influencer, I yeah, have the opportunity to see a lot of things, not everything, but see a lot of things that are behind the scenes and have information that the most of the community does not have. And because of NDA, I can't talk about it. I mean, I could, but I want to be, I want to stay an influencer. So, and I want to keep playing the game. So I'm not going to, because, you know, I signed a contract and I'm a man of my word. But I can say this, SOTOR is not dead. It isn't dead. And I think because of Kotet, because of Kofi, outside of the storyline being pretty darn good, uh, because of all that and the lack of raids and, the, and how wise to, and how it's taking so long for them to do stuff, I can see why there's this, you know, bubbling to the surface thing of the show dark dead, you're a fool for playing. I can see that. However, with Keith at the helm, with the changes they have already talked about openly about what they want to do. Uh, with the announcement of 6.0 uh, and knowing the fact that they do want to do and they will and they're just starting to work on they've talked about this already um, but you know 6.0 the new expansion how they're bringing things back to imp versus pub and kind of bringing things back to how they used to be and how we have ops now um, newer ops yes it took a little longer for them to get out but we have ops okay and they're working on pvp so there's a lot of stuff they are doing with the team that they have. So I think what we need to do is cut them a little bit of slack. And I know I'm going to get crap for all that. And I know I'm going to be called like, man, you're just daydreaming. I, you know, whatever. I don't care. But I still play the game. So here's my question 
to all those naysayers out there who are like the first ones to get into into the SOTOR Twitch chats before it even goes live. They're the first ones to start attacking. They're the first ones to run with a piece of information from a source, which we're plagued by this in the news and, and you know, the mainstream news anyways. So why is it different on the internet? But <laughs> we're plagued by these people who don't even play the game anymore. Or who say they don't, but they secretly do. Uh, but they don't want to really play the game anymore. So here's my question. Why do you care? Why the hell do you care? You don't play anymore. And I get your passion, but you don't play anymore. So who cares? Who, who cares if you think the game is dead? Stop playing. And you have stopped playing. Why bother? Why, why does it bother you? Well, it's because these people have a passion. That's one. The other one is they just want to make sure that everyone is not as happy as uh, or as the same level of happy or unhappy as they are. So this is my suggestion. If you run into those people, just ignore them. Just ignore them. Don't don't feed the trolls. And uh, Sotor is not dead. It's not. It's not. I see. I see a good future ahead of it. I do. Thank you, Keith. And yeah, so my friends, make sure you put your comments in the comment section below. Hit that like button because it helps the channel out a lot. And again, of course, hit that subscribe button. Not only does it help the channel out a lot, but we would love to have you as part of the family here. And uh, all that jazz. Anyways, I'm going to go out where it's really hot and do stuff. <laughs> Remember, my friends, be kind. It's about community. It's not dead. And we'll talk to you later. Goodbye. 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 Goodbye.